One of the things I know you'll be doing as leader uh, will be you'll be actively involved in the strategy and fundraising and so forth for Senate Democrats in the 2012 campaign. Tell us, you know, kind of what some of your major activities are already. Well, fundraising, I've been traveling around the state, meeting with different industries, meeting with different groups, and fundraising that way, but more learning those areas. And while I'm places, I'm recruiting also. Um, I spend a lot of time in Pinellas County. We think Pinellas County with Senator um, Jones um, retiring from the Senate. That's an area in which we, we could uh, possibly have a good race. And so I'm spending time down there, getting to know the community, meeting different community people way before we get a candidate and possibly recruit a candidate and knowing the community, not just recruiting a resume, but knowing the community and a person that fits and will represent that community the way they deserve to be represented. So you think there are probably some swing areas in the state where yeah. Democrats could pick up some seats? Well, definitely. I-4 Corridor is always a swing area in the state. Uh, from Volusia County down to Pinellas County, there, there are opportunities that with the right candidates and the right message and, and actually taking that message to the people, I think there's, there's tremendous opportunity to pick up a couple of seats in Florida.